watching this telecast live on AFN American Forces Networks. We're thrilled to have you. Uh, you've never been on the campus of the world renowned city of Hope Hospital in the world. You already see a familiar sight on this field the towering machine trees. This is turning hope and dreams into reality. You see well earned smiles on these riders. Uh, you'll see Ben Teller. Survivor of non Hodgkin's lymphoma. He is riding today with his stem cell transplant donor, Nancy Haig. The Rose Parade has brought these two together today, but Nancy's gift to Ben has bonded them forever. And I want you to meet a sweet little girl. This is Charlie Habib. The parade has special meaning for this 12 year old with an extremely rare cancer that affects the skin. Charlie's parents met when they worked together on the Cal Poly floor. She and her family have been part of the parade in her whole life. Today, well, she's a survivor, thanks to the wonderful city of hope. Go ahead, Micah. Hey, Stuart, have you ever dreamed about traveling to outer space? Here, the South Pasadena Tournament of Roses Association takes us all on an intergalactic vacation. This friendly alien comes to life to photograph a traveling family while other explorers take in the galactic scenery. Our home planet of Earth is in the distant background, and a 1950s-style rocket ship is tagging along for the ride. Get this, an estimated 1.5 million locally grown bougainvillea blooms are used as whole leaves and powder for the intricate decor. And incredibly, it takes 100 whole blooms to create just one tablespoon of powder. The dedication to detail here is staggering, especially considering so much of this work is done by volunteers, and I'm sure they'd love it for me to give them a shout out. All the riders on the floor are volunteer members of the construction and decoration teams for the